Hello guys, I'm Daf Super, and welcome today to this new uh, Cinema 4D tutorial. Okay, so today I'm going to explain better a bit uh, everything about uh, Ike spline on uh, body polygons and other things like this. And everyone asked me how to make Ike spline on legs, but in my my last tutorial, uh, yeah, any one of you knows how to make Ike spline. Uh, if you, if I don't make a tutorial on the leg, everyone will ask, "Hey, can you make the door on the leg?" But people don't know that it's the same thing for every single body part and other thing. So, okay, let, let me explain explain a bit better this Ike spline tutorial for Cinema 4D. Okay, for example, uh, I've created the leg with the 12 bone and yeah, Ike is flying. Let me just look. Okay, so it's made with Ike is flying, as you can see, and it works pretty fine. You can choose to. Oh, this is a glitch of Cinema 4D can do anything about it but uh, yeah like that if I go down the goal it will glitch out so don't you worry about other thing okay let me show you how to make this oh yeah of course you can make a better thing like that this is a remake a thing about my iron golem can make things like that and as you can see the the main top of the arm isn't uh, moving uh, like too much because I want that it will not move this move this part as you can see this part here so if I want to move I need to rotate it and that's yeah, that's really simple to change between spline object like that. And now as you can see it's moving a bit. Okay, let's start. For first I'm going to do it on a body. So let me create a body with segments. No other things. Let me put it up. And okay, so you have a cube subdivided in this segment. What you're gonna do is create a normal uh, chain spline, chain with join. Like that. Let me just change the setting, in my opinion. Because I love this thing. So one, um, you just need to create for every single line or point a joint like that. And then you need to second yeah that then you need to go to snap napping and enable snap you can find it over here in your template like that startup you can find it here and then oh what is that <laughs> old layouts okay okay so you can find it over here and what you're gonna do is uh, create a spline with linear go to front view and with the snap enable you just need to go from the you can see that the, the bones are from the bottom to the top so you need to draw it don't draw it from the top to the bottom it won't it will good job you just draw it how much point how much control you want I want to control 
so I just need to create three points one point for control next I need to create the IT spline and the card start go to tag at the end of the spline for the spline and make Y for the Y coordinate because the spline is easy in Y type uh, in your opinion what is better I use equal because you can stretch it out then twist the word and then you need to drop the spline and everything will stay at the same position next go to the handles and create three objects because you have added on the spline three points as you can see one the second here the third so you can add three points and now you can see that it's working you just need to bend it like contact command bind and then wait it like you prefer so let me skip this let me skip this thing a bit okay so this is my binded body and as you can see it's a bit ugly let me disable the snapping the quantiles so as you can see it's a bit ugly so what you need to do is uh, go to spline and change the type change it to B spline because it's the most curved there are so many different types of spline you can change it like your better and what you think is better for you so yeah yep okay so that's it that's all for this tutorial as you can see it's really simple and you can create things <laughs> like are really really nice with this IT spline and also it works for every single body part so let me explain you something about my new rig this is my new rig and it works for the for the fingers the fingers are made with yeah that IT spline so I just need to drag it out and everything will stay at the same position yep like that or I can drag it here and rotate it but uh, this also will stay at the same position it will not move as you can see yep so that's an example and the other example are FFD like that FFD body parts really nice also the legs FFD okay hope you enjoyed the tutorial guys <laughs> I hope this time I helped a lot of you you hope you enjoyed it don't forget to leave a like below and you will see in another tutorial. Bye-bye.